The Toronto Interior Design Show is celebrating its 20th year. You'll find all the latest decor innovations from Canadian and international designers this weekend. So Brian is back now with a preview of some of the top yes. picks. These are your top picks. You're a part of it every year. It's yes. always fantastic. It's fun to be a part of and very innovative. It is. And you know, there are design shows all over the world. And this one is really special um, and great product. And this is an opportunity. Yeah. It, it has a large majority of it is for the trade, designers and architects. But mm -hmm. there's that day or two that the public is allowed in and they can see all the latest product. Now, most of the product, I would say almost everything, is available to buy now. You go to some right. shows and it's coming up in a few years and things like that. This is all available. And they put it all out there and it is just so incredible to see. So what did you pick out for us to okay. uh, peruse now? Well, Matthew McCormick's Mila Pendant. Oh and this gosh. is very, this is hand blown, this glass. Wow. So and unbelievable. That's beautiful. And it's LED, so it doesn't get hot. And then there's rose gold metal. This oh. is very on trend. We're seeing a lot of the copper and rose gold. Yes. A great pendant over, I could see two of these over a kitchen island, yes. or over a staircase, uh, or a small round ta dining table. Great thing. Very on trend. We're seeing a lot of the hand blown glass. And it, you know, you're looking at a handmade item, but it doesn't look crafty. That's right. So there's the crafty look, which is cool. And then yeah. there's the sophisticated modern look. Very contemporary. That looks like a humongous ear to me. It would make the it sort of earring I would love. It's true, with a pearl. With Rose the, gold with and a pearl. With just a pearl. So you got like the old and the new all mixed together. It's beautiful. You always bring it back to I, fashion. I know, right? I'm so deep. You are. <laughs> <laughs> And then we have Caesar Stone. Beautiful. Now, a lot of people know Caesar Stone. They are a company that makes slab material, man-made slab material, yeah. which is great for kitchens and bathrooms and things like that um, because it's non-porous. Right. So they have so many colors. They're bringing out a lot of new colors. This is one I love. And this is cloudburst concrete and it has a mm. texture to it. Nice. And it has the feeling of a concrete or a limestone. But again, it's not porous. Right. So you can use it for a kitchen counter, bathroom vanity, things like this. There's lots that look like marbles and granites. Great product. And, and we've even used it for floors in big slabs. Oh, Expensive yeah. to do it in floors, but um, for very active spaces. Because it's fairly low maintenance, right? No maintenance. Absolutely no maintenance. No maintenance. Now, per parquette, yeah. believe it or not, this is vinyl. What? I know. I had to ask really? when we were laying it out. I'm like, which is the vinyl again and which is the wood? This is vinyl Holy flooring. Moly. Now, this is so strong. You can put this in wet areas, great for basements, but anywhere, great for kitchens and bathrooms. So you can have hardwood in your bathroom. Yeah. And it is as it's um, three percent dent fa dent factor. So okay. that means it's as strong as concrete. Amazing. So you can drop anything on this. This would be great in a home gym if you have mm. weights and things like that, but great in a kitchen. We have been using these in kitchens and we match this up to a natural wood for other areas and you can't even tell. You and can't look, tell the difference. This is beautiful. I mean that beautiful sort of blonde beachy look. Um, are we talking way more uh, affordable than here if this is vinyl? It is affordable. It's, it's not cheap, but it's affordable, yeah. but you never have to refinish it. You never have okay. to change it. And it comes in. What's important about these is there's 20 patterns, which I mean there are 20 different woods that are mixed. Mm -hmm. So it looks natural. Some vinyls, they're all exactly the same, and yeah. you know it's artificial. With this, because of the variation, yeah. it, it emulates natural wood. Very cool. And then this is their wood product. This is wire brush, so you have that texture. Yeah. It's no VOCs, which means no off-gassing from chemicals. Mm -hmm. This is all vegetable-based uh, oh, stains. Nice. Very unusual because we see a lot of alcohol based stains which are very, you can smell it, you know, when a floor is being refinished. Yeah. Um, very healthy floor. So if you have allergies and things like that, you want a floor that's it's no formaldehyde, natural. all natural, and very on trend color. Look at that color. Yeah, gorgeous. It's not gorgeous. This is really, really on trend. Uh, typically was at the very high level yeah. and high price. Now it's bringing down to a, a great level. Very They're all cool. pre-finished, so it's very fast to put down and you don't have to stain it on site. So many people are going lighter uh, now with their with their wood and their finishes and that can be the most, the biggest impact. Totally, and In it really space, reflects light. It really does, it lightens it right up. So this chair was one of your picks. Uh, yes. Very sleek, but very unique. So this is Bonaldo's Eddie chair. And this was inspired by a fixie bike, which is a very sort of old-fashioned, one-speed bicycle. Okay. But what's interesting is a lot of the furniture in the early part of the 20th century
country that was made with metal was made in bicycle workshops. Oh, really? Because they were the people that work with metal tubing. Right. So when you see any furniture like this that is from the 30s, 40s, uh, it was made in bicycle shops because they had the ability to bend the metal and uh -huh. use all the tubular. So this is, again, very on-trend color with the green, uh, the metal frame, very practical and, and cool, modern, and very comfortable. Yeah. It's wide. Very, very wide. nice. That's I, I like the fact that it's wide, actually. Very, and, and really serviceable. And if yeah. you're a real klutz with your vacuum cleaner, you're not chipping the wood legs. I always find from here <laughs> down... I can tell who's a little abrasive with their vacuum cleaner. That's so practical. It's true. You got to think about these things. Okay, this beautiful table. Hollis and Morris's polar table, mm -hmm. and they're using uh, this beautiful natural oak. Yeah. And the marble, and it's using sort of contemporary design and some very traditional materials. So a little fun with modern, but uh, more of a handmade sort of thing. But again, like the light fixture, modern handmade. That's right. Uh, but very cool, and these just screw right through the marble. So I love it. And they're different sizes and shapes. And yeah, and like they're that. different. Like the, just the order of it is yeah, really nice. Yeah, you could nice. use multiples of that and it would be cool. It's more organic. Very nice.